Hey everyone, I'm Michael Short. Come on, let's go outdoors. Well, unfortunately, this is becoming a more common sight at storm ponds throughout Alberta. Swimming in this murky storm water is a threat to our freshwater resources. Yeah, we've really been talking about this for multiple years and really not reaching all the folks that we need to. We still find new locations. Um, people just don't get that there's impacts from them releasing their goldfish because all these stormwater management ponds are made to connect with our natural waterways and that's where the goldfish are ending up. Maybe just pull it tight to the edge so that if they're swimming, they don't find a way out. With an abundance of food like freshwater shrimp, and the fact many of these municipal storm ponds are quite deep means these invasive goldfish can survive for years. I think they think it's an innocent act. They, they've cared for this goldfish pet for quite some time and they, they don't know what to do with it once they uh, don't want it anymore. And so they think a humane thing to do is to dump it in a pond like this, but uh, that's not, not the case. So uh, we ask you to maybe uh, check around with neighbors and see if you can uh, donate it to somebody else that is looking for a goldfish. Um, sometimes you can return it to a pet store. Um, and then outside of that, basically, if you can't take care of it anymore, uh, you'll, you'll have to dispose of it properly. So you'll have to kill it and dispose of it in a landfill so it doesn't uh, connect with any water body with the diseases. Once it's been verified goldfish are present in a storm pond, Alberta Environment and Parks will work with local municipalities to come up with the best solution to have them removed. But even then, it's not enough to keep up with the number of new ponds being used as dumping grounds for goldfish. So goldfish are pretty uh, generalist in their feeding as well as their habitat. Uh, they multiply multiple times in a year and that can easily outcompete our native fish. Failing to take these steps could result in our native fish being placed in serious jeopardy. It should also be noted that there are significant fines for dumping goldfish into any water body. Please don't let it loose. So if you see any uh, goldfish or any other aquatic invasive species, make sure you pick up the phone and give the Aquatic Invasive Species Hotline a call. Till next time, I'm Michael Short. Come on, let's go outdoors.